ten kitties are marching on the keys. My cat always loves to meow. Or a little bit quiet. Heavier. No, don't move in the bench. <laughs> my, my cat only loves to meow. Meow. Once more, lowest one. You get to the lowest meow. And don't jump. part about Bella. My cat Bella loves to meow. And then here she comes right now. Let's play here she comes right now a couple times. It starts with meow. Let's change the words and say meow. Here she comes. Can you say that? So it's still meow. Meow. She comes. Very good. I like the normal words. <laughs> you you like your own words. Okay. Listen, I'm gonna introduce to you today magic dice. Huh? It's a musical dice. Mm -hmm. Mommy and has you, it too. And you know why is it magical? because it knows exactly how many times you need to play to make your song better. And you know, and you can pick a color and you can even take it home so you can keep your magical dice in your music bag. Would you like to? Mm -hmm. Yes? So what color do you like better? Come on. <laughs> I think I like purple. Okay, very good. And I'll keep the red. So, what you're going to do right now, you're going to throw it. And it will tell you how many times we are going to play this ending with you. What's the words? Here she comes, right? Here. Here she comes now, right? This part. Okay, throw it. On the floor. <laughs> no, it's a magic dice. It will show it by, your, by itself. Huh. You choose four or five. I think four. You think four? Okay. Maybe five. <laughs> Maybe five? Okay. So, five. Huh? Here she comes right now. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to count. Here she comes. No. 
it's in the aisle, right? She is she owns the now. You go to four. your new song playing did you play it at home around it show me please we'll start on f remember we played note f as you learned mm -hmm. Together and play only F, G, F, G two times. Where's F? Where's F? F, G, F, G, stop. Now you move one step away with the left hand. E, A, E, move left hand. Move left hand. Left. Left is the leading one. Let's play left hand a little bit louder. with note. with you here, right? Mm -hmm. We had lots of notes. But this, but yesterday when I say it that way, guess what happened? What? I wanted to play all my songs. I'm so proud I of I even you. did this one, but all perfectly. I'm so proud of you. That's a music to my ears. Mm. <laughs> okay, now let's play here. So A is on the ground and E is in the sky.
good boy. You're right. You did a really good job. But your fingers were going here. Instead of using big arms and playing here, you did kind of like... Does it look... Look here. Does it look like pianist? It looks like kitty cat scratching the keys. Like Bella or Ollie, right? Let's play like a person. With big arms. And eagle is soars high in the sky. Look in and grow slow and says good boy. You're falling off the note. You're falling off the key. We don't want ends to fall off. No, so keep your whole hand. Think that ant lives in your hand. Can you pretend? Mm -hmm. And you don't want, if you go that low, it will fall out. Yes? Once more. <clears throat> Let's see how you can keep ant in your hand. Grand piano and play it together. Mm -hmm. And how's I know I can be done with it. <laughs> I thought you liked it. Mm, I did. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How is this new song playing? Good. Good? So do you know the difference between do you remember now the difference between A and E? So there are two notes that live on the first line, one in the treble clef and one in the bass clef. So who's who? Bear. Mm, bear. Mm. So who lives on the first line? The lines. Which notes live on the first line, sweetie? I just made a song about them. <clears throat> Yeah. So here. These are two new newer notes. B and D live in the spaces, right? E and A live on the lines. Eagle and ant, right? Okay. So when we look at this song, which note we start with? Think, don't answer. Think if it's a low on the ground. No, think. Who lives in the first line on the ground? A. A. And who lives on the first line? B. In the sky. Okay, let's play. Remember, we want to protect our ant and we want to keep it close here, close. Bell, horses, bell, horses, boat, time, all, day, two, three, four. became a little bit overcrowded and King Demeter was very worried about his notes well-being and guess who he called to help? The musical unit. 
here in Miss Karina. She came and looked at the stuff and said, I know what we can do. We can divide the stuff, grand stuff, into the room. So notes can live like in the house, real house. And notes were so happy. They called these rooms measures. Can you say it? Measures. measures. And the walls between the rooms were called bar lines. So what do we call the rooms for the notes on the grand stuff? Measures. And the walls are bar lines. It's easy to remember. Line, bar. You know why it's called bar line? Because sometimes we call measures bars. Mm -hmm. That's why the walls between them are bar lines. But it would they didn't know how many notes should live in each measure in each room so they invited two doorkeepers that would hold and show everyone open the door and show everyone how many notes and which kind of notes should be in one measure for example when we look in this door we see number two, two and number four. four we call it two four and four means you know this is equal sign right four means quarter note quarter quarter note so then we know that only two quarter notes are allowed in one measure in one bar let's see <gasps> look how many line bars we have here? How many measures now? One, two. Come, come. One, two, three. No, no, four. no, you skip. One, One two. two. Ah, you count bar lines. Three, four, four five, five, six, six seven, seven, and double bar line. Right? The end. Mm -hmm. Yes. And where are doorkeepers? Do you see them? Mm -hmm. They said, please, only two quarter notes per measure. And the song that is here is called Ice Cream. Oh. Do you like no. ice cream? On what? hot days, I love ice cream. What is your favorite flavor? Mm. Strawberry. Strawberry. Wonderful. Listen to the song, to the poem. Ice Cream. You scream. We want ice cream. We all love to eat ice cream. cream. <laughs> Very good. So let's try to play this note. But first, I'd like you, look, we have C with the line to the king, right? Mm -hmm. So let's write lines for each animal from each note. So C, C, what is this note? Look at the piano. C, C, what's next? D. D. Do we have D here? Yeah. Can we draw a line? Hmm? Either. Yeah, you can do both. To the deer, to the deer, line, good, and another one, right, good, what's this note on the first line, treble stop? D, E, E, very good, but because we are, it's a new song, we are going to read it with you together, we are not going to draw lines because it will be, dis it will disturb your vision a lot, so, Let's play from the first side. I think you can do that because you already named all most of the notes here. So let's prepare finger number two on C. And we see two notes in each measure. C, C, D, D, E, E. Back to do we have 
to change hands here. Mm -hmm. it, it's a base stuff already. Mm -hmm. No. So do we have to change hands? No. So we just let this put left hand here and we'll play all these notes in the right with the right hand only. question for you. I need you to think really carefully. Remember we told that two quarter notes are allowed in each measure. Mm -hmm. Yes? But I see only one note here. Why do you think is that? Because it's a long note. Exactly. Because how many quarters or beats are in the half note. Two. two. That's why we have only one note here, but it lasts for two beats. One, two, one, two. I'm wondering if this time we can play it and count. One, two for each measure. Let's try. Play and count. One, two. to play at the grand piano. What would you like to do? We can play rain, rain, rain from different notes or you can guess the note when I play it. What would you like? You play the note and I guess. Okay, so we are gonna play notes C, C, D, Okay, close your eyes. Good, close your eyes. Show me, we played this with the whole piece for note F last time. Mm -hmm. Can you quickly find F for me on the piano? Oh, yes, good. Close your eyes. Now I'll tell you the note and then you open your eyes and quickly find it on the piano. E. Close your eyes. D. Close your eyes, B. Close your eyes, A. <laughs> you know everything. 
today we are gonna play with you together no G. We played it deeper. Remember we played with this scale of walls and named all the notes. I'm wondering if we can do it now. We are gonna play now all the notes and say the sing their names, okay? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 